Yo, what is going on, Dodd Squad? Welcome back to another one of my videos. Today, we are going to the gym once again. Today, we are hitting up legs. I'm going to take you guys along with me because I'm starting to change my ways, guys. I want to motivate you guys. I want to inspire you to do better. I want to have a purpose, and I feel like the purpose for me to have is like start a fitness channel. I'm not saying that I'm only going to strictly do fitness stuff for my channel, but I want to start incorporating my fitness workouts to you guys because a lot of you guys liked it and you guys really enjoyed it, so I'm going to do more of it. So I'm going to take you guys with me inside today once again the same way I did last time, but this time we're gonna do legs shoulders some abs and cardio and like i said i'm trying to better myself and just better my health and just eat better do better let's just do this thing together guys so smash that like button okay guys first things first we're gonna start off some squats i do 10 to 12 reps four sets and doing squats is very important i actually recently learned how to properly do squats and you basically just want to make sure that your knees do not pass your toes and when you squeeze up at the top, it's gonna look weird, but it works to squeeze your booty cheeks together. It's very effective. Next, we're gonna be doing some dumbbell lunges. I do 10 of these going back and forth. These really, really burn. And most of the time I do a, do it till I fall and I drop the weights and I just finish with just my body. Might not seem like a lot, but my legs are already sore. And I feel like jello. I've only done squats and lunges and I'm not even done. I have one more leg workout. Okay, I'm not sure exactly what this workout is called, but this really, really burns like your whole leg it's just a really good finisher for a leg workout you basically want to take each leg and just lift them like almost to your shoulder length and you'll really feel it as soon as you finish trust me this is one of the new workouts i just started doing it's called leg dips and it is so effective guys like if you really want like a killer ending workout this is definitely the one you want to use to end it so basically just use the weight that you guys want to use i did 12 to 15 four sets ladies don't you get scared all these workouts i'm doing you guys can do too as well i've seen girls do some crazy stuff we're moving on to this shoulder dumbbell workout this is really important because it's all about controlling weight just remember that it's never about how much you lift it's all about control so I do 12 reps, four sets. And here I do 10 to 12 reps, sometimes three sets, sometimes four. It just really depends on my shoulders, if they're in pain or not. Just do not push yourself past the pain. Okay, now we're moving on to some rope ab workouts. These are actually one of my favorites. Uh, the key here is to slightly bend your knees, stick your butt out, and when you tuck yourself in, you want to actually exhale. Exhaling tightens up your abs and it's really effective. And here I do 20 reps, four sets. Now we're going to finish up our ab workout with some hanging knee ups. These are super effective, guys, if you want that really like V cut look for your abs at the bottom. These are definitely the one to do. Uh, I'm supposed to be controlling going down more, but I do 20 reps, four sets of these. <laughs> That is a wrap for leg day. Let's go. I, I have my legs feeling like jello right now, so that's a good thing. All right, let me weigh myself in. So right now I weigh 203.2 and that's with a lot of water weight. I drank at least like a gallon and a half while I was at the gym. So I have a lot of water weight now. If I took a piss, I'd probably weigh 200 exactly. Erica's here doing her makeup, but she's not using a ring light. She didn't know how to use it though. So you just plug it in and then you just flip the one on the left all the way to the right. Yeah, but that's too difficult. No, it's not. It's two steps. <laughs> You plug it in and then you just turn the knob all the way to the right. That's it. There's an attachment. You can hook your phone in between the ring. Okay, so right now I'm about to eat some blackberries and a string of cheese. I'm probably going to mix some berries with oatmeal. I just found out that my mom and Katrina aren't here. And that's kind of a bad thing because usually when they go out somewhere, that means they're getting some really bomb food and they're going to bring it back. And it's so tempting to eat it. Like, guys, I know the struggles of, like, having really good food around you. But sometimes you have to, like, sacrifice and just, like, stay on your diet plan. You know, whatever... You have your mind set to whatever you want to eat. I have my mind set right now to eat some salmon, asparagus, and some leftover rice from what Erica made last night. And guys, like, you just got to stick to it. I promise you in the end, it will work out. It's weird because like even before when I got really shredded, I ate anything. I didn't go on a diet. I just ate anything I wanted, but I just cut it in half. Usually I would eat four pizzas. I cut that in half to only two slices. So like, I don't know. It's really weird, but that was when I was like plateauing. I've been eating those Welch's vitamin packs. I know there's a better way to get your vitamins, guys. Like don't clown me. I'm just like... I like these. The Welch's gummies, they're really good to me. They're like my replacement for Gushers. Oh man, I'm so pissed. I just made my oatmeal watery and I hate watery oatmeal so much. Comment down below, how do you guys like your oatmeal? Do you like it dry, super dry, or a little moist, or super watery? Because I like mine in between. Okay, we're gonna do this egg trick from the movie La Llorona. Erica knows this. She's gonna cast some type of like spell on me or something. She's gonna use this egg, rub it on me or something, and crack it, and if it's bloody, I, I'm, I got demons. She knows how to do this. Okay. I don't know how, but it's over there. We got three eggs because Katrina and Stephanie wanted to do it too, but they're not here, so it's just gonna be me. Okay, do your spell, witch. 
I thought it was a spell as a prayer. Okay, go. Padre, Hijo, Espíritu Santo, Amen. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Rub it on my booty because I know there's demons in there. <laughs> yeah. Rub it right here too because some demon chipotle. When did you have chipotle? A while ago. I'm just trying to flush out the rest. Rub it on my nipples because that's your hand. Okay, yep. You got demons in my nipples. <laughs> yeah, get the booty good. <laughs> it's like a glass, um, glass. Glass. What? A glass. Cup? Yeah. Yes. Okay, Matt. <laughs> Put it in a glass. Way. You know what I mean. I know I got demons because I know a lot of people hate on me. There's no demons in my hair. That's from angels. Yo, and these eggs sat out all night right there. They got room temperature. We didn't cook these or nothing. So apparently what? If the egg is what? If Just... it's cooked or if it's bloody. That means um, I'm cursed? You're not, not really like cursed, but like ojeado, ojeada, like, uh, like someone gave you a bad vibe. Okay, but what if it's like a regular egg? Then what does that mean? It's just nothing? Nothing, but okay. you'll see. All right. Hey, I'm Gucci. No. What? What you mean? Look at the strings. Look at the strings up top. What about it? Do you see them? Yeah. Okay. What does that mean? It's how many people wished badly upon you. Wait, I thought if it's bloody girl. Two. Yeah, but it also has to do with the strings. Girl, now you're making a lot. No, I <laughs> swear, look it up. Wait, what are the scissors for? I'm gonna cut the egg. What's that supposed to do? Let's see if it's cooked. One, two. Two people. Two people wish bad upon me? Let's see. If it's cooked, then... Is it cooked? You don't look cooked to me. No, it's okay. So it's not cooked, I'm not cursed. She said, for how many strings of yolk there are, that means how many people wish bad upon you? They're close to you. That are close to me? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Like family members? Like close, like you know them personally. What the hell? Yeah. Damn. That's messed up, yo. Who is it, man? That means it could be one of my friends, man. See, dang, you can't trust nobody nowadays. Two of my friends or family members wish bad upon me or somebody I know. That's pretty messed up. You could have compared this to like an actual egg that you didn't crack out. Or I was just doing that. Okay, so apparently I have to dump this down the toilet myself. All right, bad vibes, 2019. Peace. Get out of here. Bye, Felicia. Okay, so now we're gonna crack a regular egg that we just took out of the fridge. So let's see the difference. I kind of still see strings though. But those are, you, you see how they're forming at the top? Like yeah. they're thicker at the top? Yeah. That's from a normal egg. Like, when they're like from rubbing on a person, they're thinner. They look like string. I believe in this stuff, but then I don't. I believe in it. I don't know. I just think the way you moved it with the egg around my body, it, it did something with the yolk. I don't know. Some people believe in this, and it, it's, there's nothing wrong with believing it. It's like, it's cool. I mean, I did it. Mine came bloody once. We need to try to get on you then, maybe. Do it right now. I can't do it on myself. What if you say it and then I, I rub it on you? All right, guys, now I'm going to cast a spell on Erica because we know she has a lot of thirsty bitches coming after her. In the name of the Father, the Spirit, right? In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Amen. Armpit. <laughs> the booty. All right, crack it open. Uh, no blood. I think you're good. There's no strange or nothing. I don't have friends, that's why. Okay, Dad Squad, that's gonna wrap it up for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for the love on the last video. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Let's try to hit 200 likes. I know we can do it. Hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications. Until next time, peace out and deuces.